Hello, this is Dr. AJ Kumar, PhD, he, him. I am the smartest mathematician who has ever lived. We are reading Euclid's Elements, book one. All right, doesn't look like I modified this last time. I was worried about that. God, motherfucking damn it. I am never going to get used to control shift S not being save as. So this is 37. So we looked through this last time. I believe it's very, very simple. Yeah, it's literally the same as this one, except we're dividing the parallelogram in two, right? Um, do, do I need to go through this reasoning? Yeah, there is literally no purpose to this proposition. It's literally useless. Okay, well we'll read we'll read through it. All right. Fine. <clears throat> Triangles which are on the same base and in the same parallels equal one another. Oh shit, I forgot to take my pill. One second. All right, let ABC and DBC be triangles. Yeah, on the same base and in the same parallels. I mean, have we already proven that half of a parallel that that ha that the that if you have if you do a parallelogram like this, it has twice its area? Probably is that let's is that that must be what one point three one is. Nope, that's parallel copy. Okay. Let me let me do it this way. Okay. I say that the triangle ABC equals DBC. Produce AD in both directions to E and okay. Draw BE through B parallel to CA and draw CF through C parallel to BD. Yeah, okay. Then each of the figures E, B, C, A, and D, B, C, F is a parallelogram, and they are equal, for they are on the same base B, C, and in the same parallels E, B, C, and E, F. Moreover, the triangle A, B, C is half the, right, half the parallelogram is at 1.34. Yeah, the diameter of the parallelogram. Yeah, so this is a diameter... Half of this parallelogram, the diameter, yeah, for the diameter, and then the triangle DBC for the diameter DC. Therefore, the triangle ABC equals the triangle DBC. Cool. Therefore, triangles which are on the same base and in the same parallels equal one another. Cool. Fucking obvious. They are not congruent triangles. They have the same area. They're obviously not congruent triangles because you can drag this one like way the fuck over here. Yeah, there's no purpose to include this proposition. The justification of the last conclusion is missing. From the justification uh, that the doubles of the two magnitudes are equal, we want to include magnitudes themselves are equal. Although Euclid included no such common notion, others inserted it later. See the commentary on common notion for a proof of this having principle based on other properties of magnitudes. Um, I really want to make like a 40 minute long video going through this one proposition at a time, not focusing like really in a lot of detail on the, on the arguments. Um, Cause I think, you know, you can read to do that. I think what I'm going to do 
is just sort of explain the manner of thinking, kind of the way that I think about it from the GeoGebra standpoint, right? Um, I might use Manim. I don't care. Oh, oops. Um, what am I doing? Um, guide. Okay, yeah, this property is used. Oh, you might be able to prove it based on other. I I don't care. It's obvious. See, this is this is the type of shit where I just don't care. Because I I, I I do care. It matters a little bit, but that's really not the point. What what matters is Euclid's way of thinking about this. And sort of the Euclidean point of view on geometry. And sort of the idea that we make constructions and properties of we can derive properties of more con of constructions through just the property of straight lines and not really not necessarily going really in formal detail about this i think there's plenty of other people that do that um should we do the next one i could do two videos today let's let's make a okay we, we know how to do this right okay uh let's do this all right this gone gone uh oh what did I do? Okay, I don't care about this negative area. Don't care about these. Um. Okay, this. What is this called? Oops. I don't know what that was, but I probably don't want to delete it. Uh, 32, Q1, Q2, and I do want to keep Q3, Q4, where's that triangle? That's going to be T something. Yeah, let's get rid of that triangle. Okay, don't need this point G anymore. We might need to rename these. Oh, I want to delete these segments. Okay. Okay, let's um, save this motherfucker. Save as. Prop 37. Prop 30s. God, mother, I, I, I'm just, I'm never going to get used to that, am I? Okay. Okay, so. Uh, what, what, what are we doing? Oh, we're making triangles. How are we renaming these, by the way? So, okay. I guess I guess here we're starting with A B C. It 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 really doesn't matter, does it? And, um. Oh, the way Euclid's doing it is that he's using a parallel copy here. I'm not going to do that. I'm not doing a parallel copy. Um. Is the parallel copy procedure is a nightmare. I'm just not doing that. Okay. Um, okay, so this point, I guess... I guess what we're going to have to do is pick the other point here. Okay. Okay. This... Just make sure it's on the line. Okay. Object properties. 
this is called this is called e right show label and what color is this this is this color and it's hollow all right and um, I'm actually we're gonna delete this purple parallelogram we're gonna delete this segment we actually don't need this point All right, and then this, this one is, that's still, this is D. All right, um, but this parallelogram we don't need. Okay, and then, all right, and then I guess this segment we want from A to E. Just to emphasize, okay, what color is this? Cool, this will be that color. And it'll be 13 and 1350. It's a great number. Um, <clears throat> let's see. It's one of the what's most important year in human history. You should Google it. Um, okay, let's make this polygon ABC. Cool. And I guess we still want the other polygons. So D. Okay, so this one, motherfucker. Okay. This one is going to be. Oh, god damn it. Why, GeoGebra? Why? Why are you like this? All right, basic. Blue triangle area. <sighs> Come on, GeoGebra, get your shit together. Okay. Actually, okay. And then I guess we want to highlight that they that the areas here are half the parallelograms. Right, this is what matters is this parallelogram area. Okay. And let's just do Okay. Color this will be blue. I'm going to keep the opacity right where it is. And I'm going to say, come on. And I'm going to say that it is the blue parallelogram area. And we want caption and value. And then. Son of a bitch. This, I, I, I genuinely think these people need a reward for just designing the mo. I don't understand how you can design a program that is both unbelievably useful and just the most infuriating program on the planet. And then just, I don't know. Uh, purple parallel area. Okay and value color all right cool purple triangle area purple okay it says that these two this is a bit cluttered but I don't really see a better approach okay 
This is pretty straightforward, right? Yep, this this is a good. Cool. All right. I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Uh, bye.